Today, I am going to review this wonderful Keltec CMR30. This is an incredible gun. I showed you earlier my another Keltec just like this, except for it is a short pistol. This is the assault rifle version of that incredible pistol. And now I tell you the five things that I like about this gun and five things that I do not like about this gun. So the first thing I like about this gun is how short and compact and simple it is. See how short it is? And then you can extend this and now it's now you can shoot it like a regular rifle. Bang, 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 bang. Number two thing I like about this gun, I like it that it is super, super lightweight. This gun is made out of mostly plastic, a little bit of metal for the rails and a little bit of metal for the barrel. But since it's a 22 Magnum, it doesn't have to be very thick or very strong. Uh, very lightweight materials. So if I'm doing training all day long, I can use this as my practice gun and I don't have to get fatigued, uh, muscle fatigue, because I'm not carrying a heavy rifle. This is super lightweight and I can do all my training, all my practice, and it's good. It's very, I like that. Number three thing I like about this gun, I like these sights how you can put them down so that they don't catch on things or whatever. And then as soon as you need to shoot this, you can pop it up, boom, boom. It's spring-loaded pop-up mechanism. So then it makes it very easy to uh, to get ready to shoot. If I'm if I'm going through the brush and stuff, I don't have to worry about these breaking off or anything. So I like it that. I go like this, boom, boom, and I kill the target, boom, boom, kill the other target, and boom, boom, kill the other target. Number four thing I like about this gun, this gun never jams. Just like the little pistol that I, I did a review on earlier, it is very rare that this gun jams on me. I know that if it has bullets in it, boom, 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 I pull the trigger, boom, 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 and it's going to shoot. So number five thing I like about this is uh, I like uh, the ambidextrous cocker. So right here, and then right here. I like uh, that you can cock it from both sides, and it's very easy to cock. It's a very ergonomic, very intuitive cocking mechanism. And that's the number five things I like about this gun. Now I tell you the five things that I do not like about this gun. The first thing I do not like about this gun, I do not like that this has a very cheap feel about it. It's mostly plastic. I like my guns to feel like high quality. This is a high quality gun that does not feel high quality. Number two thing I do not like about this gun, this grip is very plastic, not ergonomic. It's not comfortable. I would like a nicer grip. So number three thing I do not like about this gun. I think up to 100 yards is probably about the limit of how we can be accurate. It's hard with the iron sights. Maybe it'd be a little bit easier if you put the uh, uh, scope on it and you definitely could, but the way it comes, you can't shoot it very far and have it be super accurate. Maybe somebody out there can. If you can, put it in the comments below. I have never had a gun before that there's only three things that I do not like about this gun. I told you that I was going to tell you five things that I do not like about this gun. I tried very hard to find the last two. I just love this gun. It's a great gun. There's not five things I don't like about it. The things that I do not like about this gun are not very important. For the most part, this is a very great gun. I love this gun. So I'm going to keep this gun. I will never sell this gun, okay? Now let's go have some fun and shoot this gun, okay? Come on with me. Okay, my friends, we're going to uh, shoot at this Keltec CMR 30. At the targets, we got some Mountain Dew, we got some, uh, we got some uh, metal targets, and let's see how this uh, performs, okay?
this was pretty accurate. Sometimes it's very hard because the front sight is black. And so I think uh, sometimes the black sight on a black target makes it hard for me to aim. And uh, there's, as you can see, there's some black targets over there. Overall, I love shooting this gun. This is super fun, super inexpensive to shoot. Um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, shooting this gun with me and I hope you enjoyed uh, the review. Um, I hope you come back next time. Please like and subscribe. Uh, I'm growing my channel. I'm, I'm, I'm adding guns that I'm going to shoot um, and review. I've got some very incredible guns. So this is going to be an exciting channel. Please come back. I love you very much. You have a good day. Goodbye.